The BJP has released some PWD documents alleging that two bungalows adjacent to Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal's house were vacated so that uh, his uh, place could be expanded. Delhi government sources say that these allegations are totally false. My colleague Saurav Shukla reports. BJP's social media chief Amit Malviya putting Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal in the dock. Allegedly, Kejriwal plans to expand his residence without following due process. In a tweet, Malviya alleged government houses adjacent to the chief ministers are being vacated and demolished to expand the current complex. Two bungalows on eight Flagstaff Road and eight flats on neighboring 45 Rajpur Road have been vacated. Documents reveal this decision was taken by the Delhi government in 2021 and soon after notices were issued to all the occupants of flats. पहले कहावत थी कि जनता जगह खाली करो राजा आ रहे कुछ यही हालत आज के मुख्यमंत्री अरविंद केजरीवाल साहब की है कि राजा साहब आ रहे हैं इसलिए अपने अपने जो फ्लैट हैं वो खाली कर दो ताकि वहां जो है शीश महल को बढ़ाया जाए जो दस्तावेज सामने आए हैं उसमें साफ पता लग रहा है कि राजा साहब के लिए शीश महल बनाने के लिए आठ फ्लैट खाली कराए गए दो बंगला खाली कराए गए ताकि राजा साहब का शीश महल और बड़ा हो सके द डेली गवर्नमेंट एंड द आम आदमी पार्टी हैव नॉट ऑफिशियली रिएक्टेड सोर्सेज इन द डेली गवर्नमेंट डिनाई द एक्सपेंशन एलिगेशन दे से द हाउसेज वर वकेटेड टू मेक फ्लैट फॉर डेली गवर्नमेंट ऑफिशियल एंड दैट Type 4, 5 and 6 flats will be built on the vacated plots. This controversy comes on the back of BJP releasing some documents alleging that the Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal has spent Rs 45 crore on renovating his house. According to the sources of Delhi government, in these PWD documents there is no mention that these houses were vacated for the purpose that Arvind Kejriwal's house will be extended. There is no mention of that. But now the big question is, will these charges be investigated? Will there be any FIR registered against Arvind Kejriwal? Or this is only for perceptional battle against Ahmadni Party. In New Delhi with Manoj Thakur Saurabh Shukla for NDTV.